वेलकम टू मरीन टेकअप टूडे आई लाइक टू थैंक ऑल माई सब्सक्राइबर्स ऑल ओवर दर्ल्ड फॉर मेकिंग मरीन टेकअप टू दी हाइएस्ट लेवल मेंबरशिप लेवल फाइव विल गेट फुल सपोर्ट फॉर वन ईयर एंड आई विल बी शेयरिंग यू द वीडियो लिंक्स सो पीपल आर कॉलिंग फ्रॉम द शिप फ्रॉम चीफ इंजीनियर टू कैडेट लेवल आई एम ट्राइंग टू हेल्प दैम फॉर द ट्रबल शूटिंग which will save time and money and off fire of the ship so today i'm going to explain about me engine troubleshooting okay before i start i will like to tell little detail about this uh, a slide what is here so this ship we got 12 12 cylinders uh, hcu means hydraulic cylinder unit H, hps means hydraulic power supply okay now mpc is in the normal mode here so i have shown the mpc picture here how it look like this is the me engine here then we have the this is the fifa wall i have shown the picture here and in real you can see how this will look here okay this is the exhaust wall you can see the wall here and the sensor is fixed here to check the stroke so right now uh whenever you do this kind of a test we need to conduct the toolbox meeting and risk assessment make sure you have conducted everything correctly make sure the engine is in the stop condition and we need to start the hydraulic system on the pressure is 207 bar and one more important thing is you have to change mpc to the test mode mpc this is the mpc here now it is normal mpc is nothing but multi purpose controller ccu is cylinder control unit now it is in the unit number 2 okay so before i go we have here alarm engine auxiliary system view then you have invalid input network function test right now troubleshooting so before you do the test you should be in the chief mode here okay this is very important now uh, you can see the fuel plunger position you can see channel 31 showing 6.6 and this is value is showing 0 and stroke is 0.2 exhaust you can see here channel 34 you can see the dotted mark this is the exhaust this is the sensor here so when the exhaust wall moves you will get the stroke okay so you can see this is coming all the way from j34 for fifa we have the signal coming from you can see here it's coming from the amplifier here so it's coming j70 then j91 then j30 then you can see what signal is coming you can see fifa channel 33 right now it's showing 5.9 amps and you can see here and output you can see j30 J30 you can see the rotted line coming here the viva position you can see channel 30 7.6 milliamps and you can see this is the uh, plunge fuel plunger positioner sensor here you can see this is J31 and you can see the rotted line coming here this will tell you uh, channel 31 right now it's showing 6.6 milliamps okay okay so this is the main operating panel mop here so all the details here we will second slide. the second slide we are changing this already this was in normal mode we have changed it to test mode as soon as we change the test mode you can see the warning coming here saying that operating with low hydraulic pressure might damage the accumulator so accumulator is always connected to the system here which i will be explaining in one of the other videos now another warning operating with fuel that is operating with out fuel oil pressure might damage the fuel booster okay so fuel pressure should not be the it will may damage the booster okay right now here in this we have inject 
return open close cycle start okay so other things i have already explained now we have come to this point now next we will press inject once we press inject you will see the value right now here it is not showing any value here first we will inject for testing uh, fuel plunger position here first then later we will test for the exhaust valve opening this value will come over here okay guys so this slide you see the test you see this warning here now the signal has to come here once you press the start cycle now we have pressed the start cycle here now you see the inject so once you inject the signal will come from mpc here so you can see the signal coming here you can see 12 milliamps and you can see uh, the fifa position channel 30 11.6 milliamps okay the fifa wall i'm sh shown here and you can see uh, once this is moving you can see the fuel plunger position dotted mark here channel 31 showing 11 milliamps here and you can see the stroke 52.3 mm and you can see here 5.2 milliamps okay guys so this is for the we have tested for the inject okay so once we inject we are able to see that the fuel plunger position is moving okay if if it is not moving if you are not getting any signal here maybe the sensor is faulty again if the signal is not coming here then maybe the uh, uh, feedback sensor is not working fifa feedback sensor is not working you have to change the sensor okay uh, let's move to the other slide now we want to test the exhaust valve open okay once you want to test exhaust valve open you have to press this so now you can see this one no signal is coming as soon as press open one person need to stand near the main engine and check whether the exhaust valve thing is moving you will come to know similarly when inject fuel plunger inject was there again some person one person need to stand near the main engine and see the feel of the inject of the fuel in the high pressure line okay so that you can see that now it is an open uh, we have given open here you can see the signal is coming from the mpc and you can see exhaust valve has moved the stroke has come to 129.1 mm and you can see the channel 34 showing 18.5 milliamps and here showing 12.9 milliamps so this is the sensor if it is not coming the sensor may be faulty if it is not working that means sensor change the sensor and then again do the test you will be able to understand now we have come to the final stage uh, stop cycle okay we started it so we have finished testing the uh, fuel plunger position side we tested the exhaust valve position side okay guys this was in the test mode once you finish then you can uh, try out the engine okay so this test can be done for each of the unit so if you feel that one of the unit not working all right then you can do the test okay guys if you like the video please subscribe have a nice day my whatsapp number is there my email address is there you can message me for any troubleshooting with me engine i'll be helping you all thank you very